Welcome back to Good Morning Vale. I'm very excited to introduce you to our next guest. So we have Kiki and Josh here in the studio, which, let's be honest, you probably recognize these two, right? And, uh, and oh, Josh, <laughs> you, my Josh. friend, you know, usually when, when we're together, we talk about real estate. <laughs> right. Today, we're talking about you shaking it. Totally other for a good cause. persona. <laughs> Yeah. I'm not a real estate broker no, in this conversation. No, you are <laughs> July a 18th, dancer. July 18th, I'm not a real estate broker. No. I'm just a, a dancer. <laughs> not a professional <laughs> dancer, but I... <laughs> oh, but he's going to try. Exactly. So, <laughs> try is the word. We're, yes, we're going to get back to you in a second. But yeah. Kiki, tell me about why Josh is dancing. What, what, is, what is he benefiting <laughs> with his moves? So on July 18th, which is next week, right? right? Mm -hmm. Crazy. Yeah. Uh, Youth Bar 365 is having our ninth annual Star Dancing Gala. So we are benefiting the youth in the community. We have early childhood through high school programming, and, and we do a lot for kids here in the community. Okay, so you end up with some local celebrities that dedicate their time to learn <laughs> their dance moves, and then you put on this huge event. So how long have you been practicing? Uh, it seems like a couple of years now. <laughs> um, I started in May, which was apparently uh, late compared oh, to a lot really? of the other dancers. Yes, we started second week of May, and I didn't realize. I thought it wouldn't take very long. Yeah. And I didn't realize um, how you need every single minute of rehearsal <laughs> to be ready for this thing. Um, oh, man. And so, yeah, so I've been, yeah, I guess, seven weeks or so, and we've okay. got another few. So it ends up being about 20 to 25 hours per dancer with their professional partners. Okay, and, so you're paired with a right. professional. Yes, with Maria okay. Barry, who's been doing this event for a long time and has okay. been in the Valley for 25 years, or working with the Vail Academy of Dance for 25 years with Colin and still teaches ballet and still teaches jazz and hip hop to, to kids. So it's pretty funny when I walk in and there's all these like little ballerinas in there and they're looking at me <laughs> like, what are you doing here? Where's your well, tutu? Yeah, and, like, yeah. are you picking someone up? I'm like, no, I'm here to dance. I have my shoes in my hand. It's just like, <laughs> yeah. Oh, and can you tell us what style of dance you're going to be doing? Yes. So something I knew nothing about until I showed up. I was just telling Kiki in the lobby that I fully expected to come in and do sort of a hip hop -y, funky thing and then um, with the music I selected constant you know other people are doing those steps disco and different things so I'll have you do East Coast Swing and it's kind of like a jive almost quick step it's very fast the song we're dancing to is, is complicated um, oh, and man. so there's a lot of moves and then we go in and out of kind of freestyle side by side and separated separated and then back together and and then uh, you know, kind of a, a jivey type of uh, dance, so it's fun. I am so excited. <laughs> Me I, too. I mean, freestyle and j that is so hard, Josh. Like, it that's is hard. Really hard. <laughs> yes. Wow. You're Did you right. and you picked your own song? I picked my own song, and I, in my perception, in my head, you know how you like you sing in the shower, right? Yeah. You don't mm -hmm. think you're like yeah. a professional singer. In my head, I've been listening to the song forever, and I thought this is how I would dance. You're like, if this is my this song. song came on. It's the, like a theme you know, song. the DJ played this. <laughs> And I'm not dancing anywhere near how I imagined I would dance the song, and it's actually a lot more fun. And I love that I'm learning something I've never done before. Yeah. I love the challenge. I, I love just uh, doing something that is just completely foreign to me. So it's been great. I, oh, I love man. it. Okay, well, listen, you know you want to see Josh actually perform live. So, Maybe. Kiki, how do people get tickets? When, when exactly? Like, what time? Where is it taking place? So, tickets are still available. You can go to startingsingala.com. The event is Tuesday, July 18th at 5.30 p.m. at the Vail Valley Jet Center. Okay, well, listen, you guys, we're, we're already out of time because it's, it's so exciting to talk about you and your dancing. You don't want to, like, leave us with some moves. I don't. <laughs> Give us a little preview. When, when that thing goes off, maybe I'll just slide out of here with something. But maybe. Yeah, not, right. not with that. Just going to have to wait till the big show. Well, listen, thank you guys so much for coming on this morning. And again, for more information, stardancinggala.com. Coming up next, we'll be checking in with Ken Hovey and his epic morning.